it's, it's time to uh, take action. You know, it's like, you know, okay, you talk the talk, now can you walk the walk? The only way we're gonna move as a people is to organize as a people. We have come to tear down, to rebuild, share life, give hope, lend courage, honor ancestors, and guide you. The time and place is here and now. This is Jay Blaze, and I'm standing here with Eugene the Fourth. How you doing, brother? Good, brother? All right, all right. Tell me a little bit about your history as a jazz saxophonist. I've been playing uh, saxophone since uh, like fifth grade, man. So I was a little dude in the band, you know, when everybody else was squeaking and stuff and thought it was funny. I was the one that took it like super serious. Like, man, that ain't funny, man. We sound bad, you know. <laughs> so uh, I've been playing sax since fifth grade, and uh, jazz is one of the things I play. Um, I played a lot of gospel, you know, uh, played with some rock bands, uh, played with some uh, Afrobeat bands, a lot of hip hop bands, yeah. um, even some like alternative, you know, folksy kind of bands. Okay. I'm sick of being tired, about to tired of being sick. What was light as a feather is heavy like bricks. So I lay it by the river. God, please deliver me from all the hinders. To lay at you the center and re enter your will. Surrender in mind, feeling it's time to let it go. Here is where I draw the line between what I've done and what I'm gonna do. Freedom now to everybody, listen. Get up, get in position, only yesterday. Keep you from living and loving today. We've been there and we've done it, now let's step away from it. I don't know about you, but I ain't waiting on the new year for this resolution. Ain't no debate and execution is the best solution. See, God is broken in it. Gotta turn it loose. It might be this for me and that for you. One thing is true. Procrastination ain't gonna let us grow. We gotta live, so we gotta go. We've been here. You have a new release out, uh, your debut CD. Uh, it's called Eugene the Fourth, Starving Artist. Tell us, tell the audience a little bit about what they can expect in um, when they put this in their CD and listen. Okay, uh, well you got it exactly right, Eugene the Fourth, Starving Artist. Uh, it's a CD that was in the works off and on for about five years. Uh, I had some executive producers or backers, Youth Ensemble of Atlanta, that decided to uh, back me, man. So I was able to complete it. It's basically a hip-hop soul record, you know what I mean? Um, a lot of people are like, you know, well, you can't label my stuff. Well, you can't really fit my stuff in a category. You know, mine is kind of what you need it to be to hear what I'm saying, you know? But if I had to pick two categories, I'd say it's a blend of hip-hop and soul.
Now, let me know, uh, what were some of your influences uh, when you decided that this is what you really wanted to do? What was your muse, if you will? Okay, uh, as far as like artistic influences? Yes. Oh, wow, man. They range from, um, as far as my uh, soul music influences, of course, Donnie Hathaway, Stevie Wonder, uh, Bill Withers. Uh, love me some Bill Withers, man. Um, as far as hip hop influences, Public Enemy, um, Brand Nubian, Poor Righteous Teachers, uh, De La Soul. Uh, wow, man, so many. Probably some I'm not even thinking of right now. You know what I mean? Absolutely. You know, I, I will say it's, it's pretty hard, man, for me to kind of narrow down my influences because my influences, a lot of times, because I'm still influenced. You know what I mean? So a lot of times my influence depends on what mood I'm in. 